Alright everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we're playing some Vex, and we're running Electrocute, Taste of Blood Eyeball, Ultimate Hunter, Biscuits, and Time War. We are playing Vex top, because I thought I was mid, but uh, I didn't realize that till yeah, I got in game. But, we're against Aurelia, so it might not be that bad, because Vex is really good versus people who have a lot of dashes. But unfortunately, Aurelia can heal a lot of our poke back, but... I mean, if I kill her in lane... We should be okay, actually. Damn. They did buff uh, Vex passive recently, and a champion like Aurelia is actually going to activate it more than Echo, so... I might actually have somehow mistakenly gotten into a better matchup. Aurelia falls in that category of champions that make the user feel like they're faker. Aurelia, Yone, Akali. Calm down, Shadow. I'm trying they look flashy, so but they're super easy. <sighs> We're gonna go uh, Ludens first. Not sure what second. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, for Aurelia players, Way to die, everybody clapped after that. Now I'm in a bad spot because I don't have TP and she does. She's going to teleport back. He's either going to freeze the wave or TP up. Or push it. If she pushes it, we're looking pretty good. Oh! Actually crashed in the turret, so it should push back to me. It might not reach some of these. It'll push. We're fine. Okay, so we're going to loot in Shadow Flame Sword Shoes. An enemy has been slain. I can't really buy anything else. How about a moat? Yeah, their team has uh, quite a few dashes. Echo Dash, Kane Dash, Aurelia Dash, Triss Dash, Maokai Dash. So, Vex is actually super good here. We just played uh, Poppy yesterday's video, so this is fitting. Anti Dash Vamps. So, she tried to freeze it, but instead she's just slow pushing a gigantic wave into me. As long as the thing I need to do right now is when you see somebody doing this, I don't want to go up and fight her right now because she's got more minions than me. So, she just dashes like two of these. All ends me. I lose the fight. I could really and I don't even want to try and clear the wave here. I want to wait for it to get over here. Let her do her thing. I can clear some of them. I wouldn't do that. But not all of them. Do you really players, the bad ones, they only know how to do one thing and that's all in you. The good ones can actually still play the game. But the bad ones just look for an all-in level 2 or 3. Oh, that kind of glitched out. Her. See, this is a bad Aurelia because she's just looking all-in. Imagine if I feared her under turret there. Kind of out of mana. I should get another biscuit though in 30 seconds. So we'll just hold the wave here. Once she comes back to lane with the vampire scepter though, she kind of heals the full HP every wave. So I think I can auto her every time she dashes. And see? She's not a good Aurelia. Because all they know how to do is all in. But, okay. I'd say 90% 90, 90 of Aurelias are not good Aurelias. I'm only in and now that she days. hasn't been able to cheese me on the first few waves, Later. she's in trouble. Because I'll just keep 
going in when I know I can beat her. But I do feel like I kind of counter her. Look, we get a dark seal. I don't have enough for a dark seal, but I kind of want one. But also, I could very easily die this game to Kane Echo, so I won't buy one. Okay, she has near infinite sustain now. When she has Blade of the Rune King, though, you have to be very careful. You know what, Shadow? What I can do is, uh, when she dashes, use the auto attack. I can bait this. I'm gonna say save my ability to fear her. Oh, my cannon. Nice kill. Um. I want this. I could die to Kane. I can maybe fear him away, but he's probably gonna end up flashing on me. But nice. Not a bad kill. And it's close though. I could pick up the seal now. I mean, if I get fed enough, I can pretty much one shot anybody I hit my ult on. And even if I lose the stacks, it's not the end of the world, because the item gives good stats. Injured should be able to clean this up. One more auto, he's dead. Uh oh. There we go. Oh, nice. I think the only way Aurelia beats me in a fight now is if she, like, all ins me and hits everything before I can poke her a little bit. Because an all in fight, if I use everything, hit everything, I probably do like 80% of her health. And then she'll keep auto attacking, so I'll die. Uh, I think I'm gonna shove this wave in. I don't know where Kane is. I definitely don't want to get ganked. Oh, there he is. Another pink. Guess I'll loop over here. I'm just chilling. I'm gonna let her push this wave in. She'll automatically push. As long as I don't use any spells, this wave will go into me. Because she's going to queue the minions when they get low. But I think she's not queuing anymore. Ever. She's not. <laughs> so I don't activate my passive. Because, I mean, look at that. That's extra, like, 100 damage. I love my shield. But yeah, see, I don't really do enough to actually kill her. Womp, womp, womp. See, she thinks she's faker because she just dashed a million times. But she didn't actually do anything. Kane's mid. I think she has TP though, so I'm not gonna stay for this. Yep, predicted correctly. Out of Ludens. I need Sork shoes. I don't have enough. I don't want to sell. Uh, I don't want to sell boots. Ah, she got Mercs. I wonder if she had Mercs when I was uh, fighting her last. I don't think she did. But yeah, she can go Mercs wits, and even if I'm super fed, I I lose to her still, which is. That's why I don't like playing against Aurelio. Where she's still building damage items, but also gets full resistance and tenacity. 
But if I build damage item, I don't have enough. Alright, if I build defensive item, I don't have enough damage to kill her. We make sure we don't lose these. I could try and kill Kane. Think sad thoughts. Think sad thoughts. Ooh, the Ari's pretty fed too. It's scary to have these shutdowns though versus these snowbally assassin camps. Like I'm four and over Sorelia, she can easily kill me. I do need to kill some other champions so I can get a my ultimate hunter. Ooh, level 11 is a pretty big upgrade for me. I get extra range. Down he goes. Well, that went right by him. He went over the wall. Really is just kind of taking my turret. Watch the 0 4 Aurelia kill Kindred here. I'm gonna try and fight her. Wise. If a uh, kindred slows her, I'll kill her. Well, I guess the good thing is she needs a lot of money to get a wit's end because she's going blade first and she's still not even close to finishing that. I'm doing a lot of damage because Merc Treads is like basically building a force in nature versus a mage early. But the sword shoes I got actually helped me out a lot. Do a little fight you now. Bring it down a notch. Oh, I got blue buff. Oh my god. <laughs> I didn't even give her the chance. I think Echo's coming up. Where is he? Oh, you want me to help you, and uh, I wanted you to help me. Could have taken it. You might lose cannon even better. Yep. Well, she's gone. Into the wits now. I am not yeah, at least she got the kill. I get free haste. An ally has been slain. I don't want to push this because I don't want her to farm for free under a turret, but I mean, I did kind of just kill her under a turret. But I already poked her down a bit first. Not even give her XP on this cannon. 10 seconds to go grab this red. Can we get some rain clouds in You must have saw me in here. Don't even 
even think about it. Oh, it ran out. I mean, I couldn't really take it anyway with Kane waiting there. I could have probably killed her though. But I wanted to farm the wave first. Okay, Kane, yep. I think, is still here. Alpha is here. Nice, I hit him. Got wit smirks, double tenacity. Well, maybe I just give top and I go team fight, but she's gonna get the turret and probably get another one. He's leaving. Really nice wave clear since I'm so fed. Malkai's not here. Power. I need Shadow Flame, and I need like 50 you know gold. And then Waka. Kane's coming up. I think I try to kill Kane before I kill her. Trying to bait me into getting closer, because Kane's here. Um, I might have to go void next. I mean, Aurelia is the only one building magic resist, but I might be stuck top lane against her. Yeah, I can give up top turret. What? I just like hovering over Vexalt to see how far it'll go. My W just deletes. But unfortunately, Aurelia just push, push, push. I think I'm gonna go this. I mean, I'm like one-shotting the rest of her team, so I may as well just build this to actually do damage to her too. See, she's got nothing to lose. She could push forever. Doesn't matter if she dies. Okay, time to take it down a level. Could go Crypt Bloom, get a little bit of haste too, so I could have my ult up more. I wanted to try Malignance Vex. Because I was testing in practice tool, you can actually get two burn circles on it. One on the initial, and then you wait for it to run out, and then you take it, and then it hits them again. Which works, actually. That Kindred Mark will scare her off, even if Kane's up here. Need a push in Rome. I can feel it. Damn, if I still had my ult, I could go for a penta. But I wish. Oh. 
Alright, she got executed. <laughs> I'm getting out of here. A little bit too risky to stay. Get to leave. Uh, Magi's or Void. I kind of want to get the Magi's. I'll do it. I'm going to do it just for the one shots. It's like, I only need the pen versus her. And no in a team fight, my team's going to kill her anyway. Dude, like she randomly just like, nah, I'm not going to go that way anymore. Baron, that's a little risky, but Echo's bot. He does have TP. Doesn't look like they even know we're doing this. I thought that was a teammate. I knew since they were running back at us though that this they were gonna go in. Somebody was flanking. I think I go death cap last. I have alt, but I'm so close to 16 that it might be better to wait for the extra range and lower cooldown. Oh shit. Really got cheese. I wonder how long they were waiting in there. That sucks. I'm a giant stacks. At least I got four back. Very cringe. Well, we get dragon. One more off soul. Where's she going next? I feel like she actually beats Ari in a 1v1. It wasn't a 1v1. Oh, a lot of damage. Good ult. They ruined my KDA by cheesing. No. <laughs> one, two, one, two. I could one shot Kane. Gotta be careful though. He could use his ult and pretty much dodge everything. Shut 
little bit of throws. So hard to hit the alt sometimes. Seems about right. I would actually lose to her 1v1. A 14 in 1 Vex would lose to a 1 in 8 Aurelio. I'm just not designed to, uh, fight somebody who just keeps hitting. I either have to burst them or uh, I don't. I kite and burst. One of that Triss. We should probably just play for soul. Oh my god. Okay, how did that not hit? That went right through him. I was like, okay, I can get Echo Walls here. Oh, I got Echo. That is a lot of damage. Basically, the combo is you just ult, dash in, hit him with W and Q, and that's like 2,000 damage right there. Death is the true of life. Whoa, that's deep. Echo can burst me pretty hard, but... He's gonna get hit by my W and I get a shield when he goes in. And he gets feared, so he might not be able to ult right away after going in. Yes, all. Oh, nice kindred all. Well, we can get an inhib and then dragon. Pain's gonna be up. We need to be careful. She's gonna, if she dies, we lose dragon. May position in between the dragon and uh, kindred, or pain and dragon kindred. Okay, that was literally just an E auto Q. Well, I got deathcap blue pot. I am max damage vex right now. Nine sixty three AP. Oh, that Trist is gonna die. That's gonna be GG, most likely. That go. I think we saw him top. You know, I wasn't planning on playing Vex Comp, but I dig it. My auto attack is extra 400 damage. 50 seconds on alts, I don't think we'll be able to use it again. I mean, I almost one-shot the turrets. Look at this. Let's go sit back. Oh, she got caught. Boom. Boom. Oh. I don't know what I killed him with. 
auto. Well, 21 kills, Infernal Soul. Almost a thousand eight. That's pretty. Let us see the damage. Yeah, but I don't know. The last few days, I've literally. I perma ban Akali just. Like, not because she's, like, too broken. She's just really annoying to play against. But she's also pretty broken. But the downside is I have to play against Yones and Aurelias and deads and stuff every game nobody plays mages you know mages are decently strong right now the mage it just sucks playing mage into the assassins because it's just very they have an easy mode playing against them i don't even give it to well ari didn't give me mid i'll give it to kindred oh kindred actually did more damage to me i wasn't always fighting though i was just bursting 2k on this and yeah make sure to like the video if you enjoyed subscribe comment peace